here he here he comes introducing the great baggy his elemental attacks are sleep although I do believe he uses some ice at some point there we go a sleeping thing that's gonna that would have put me to sleep had I been hit by it now I wanna speed things up don't really have that much YouTube time Okay, he's now he's calling upon his trusted minions. So they can follow him in death. Okay, just gonna do this so I don't have to change the weapon style. This guy's actually nice to fight. Sometimes when monsters are big, it actually makes things easier. Since you don't have to worry about uh, getting hit by stuff such as tails in this case I think he hit me I just didn't get knocked back or staggered ah damn that rock <laughs> gotcha tail basically the most efficient way of using the switch X is doing intervals of X, others of sword, and don't want to use its ultimate sword attack since it consumes energy that could have been used just in sword mode to do, to, for the dealing of lots of damage oh this guy just perfect, <laughs> he's so tall he can't hit me when he turns around with a tail come on, come on buddy one minute hey I just sharpened my weapon I'm gonna spend all this if I have low, low sharpness so someone entertain them please good work Invictus now where is he? just Him. Ah, wasteful. I love the range this attack has. It really goes very forward. Ooh, how did I hit him up there? Was that a sleep thing from one of his minions? I think it hit me. Crap. Drowsy. I'm drowsy. Hit me, please. Thank you! If that had continued, I would have been put to sleep. And yes! Maybe this guy is weak now. No, 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 no! I'm crap. I already have some editing to do. Probably gonna cut something out of the great shaggy scene. That part in the end of me carving and s stuff. Just so you know, all the carves are mega potions. In case I have to cut off that part. Come on! Same thing applies for all shinies. Come on! Die already. I already knew I wouldn't have enough time for this. Okay, now I have to switch into X. Let me just try to hack him away. Hack away one more time. I mean, really, did I just do this many hits in a row? I'm not gonna really sharpen it. They're nearly dead, so. Really? You went and recharged. Nice. Die, bastard! One minute of editing. Ah. Yes! 
Thank you. Very useful. Oh, that's nice. You know, I could do that. Do a small jump right before having to change into switch X form. Come on. Kill it now. If it, if you paid attention throughout the fight, you may have noticed some hits were orange instead of red. That meant it was a critical hit and dealt just about is it twice or more 50% of the damage. No idea. Come on. Ah, again. Okay, I think it's ready and it's not. I mean, really? Am I really gonna have to put this in two parts just so I can fit in three minutes? <sighs> just die already. But literally, die. How is it I've been going at it for a long time, just trying to deal damage, not worrying about my health or anything, and I'm still alive. I have no idea. <sighs> Spartacus hit me! Where's the bomb? Where's the bomb? Yes! That's a nice tip for you. I'm losing... Gonna go to sleep, get hit by something. The less damage it deals the best, obviously. Yes! Finally! So, here we are, back from the quest. Just gonna take this time, since I already have a video of 5 minutes of battle, or 7 or whatever. I'm just gonna show you some of the things around. I know that in the previous episode I showed you the farm, I'm just gonna show you the rest. Here is the item shop, pretty regular, like the other times. This is the Catwoman. She's actually a bit different because you can actually request a specific cat and cats have boomerangs. There are tendencies, but you can only choose one of them, so be careful. But other than this, she actually brings a lot of cats, as you can see, 10, which you can buy as usual and see their style. However, there aren't co cooking cats, as you can see, there's just the um, hot spring, that's it. Also another thing, no idea why, why this is useful. Ah, no, no, no. Sometimes I get hot spring eggs in here when I press square. They actually increase my natural recovery rate. This is the useless woman, this is, which is in every game. Basically just sells you the most basic stuff and allows you to sell equipment. <laughs> She's good for nothing else. <laughs> there is the same thing here, but as you can see here, and you can also see the woman, things are divided by the actual weapon type, while in the other Monster Hunter Freedom Unite, the Great Sword and Long Sword were together, and Great Swords could evolve into Long Sword, and the opposite could happen rarely. Uh, anyway, this is something really bothersome, which is you actually have to press start, see the weapon, I actually like to see them. This is just the number of weapons I can use right now. Yeah, I'm finish showing this weapons. This one's really beautiful. What's it made of? Okay, maybe I'll get this one. Yeah. Um, you can you can also see as usual the things necessary. After after pressing square comparison from the weapon and no, this is just to so show things. Just gonna sh whoa. No, I have new weapons. What is this made of? Giganox, yeah, from the previous pre previous episode, or this one and what? Okay, let me see. I actually think these weapons look really awesome. I mean, is this a fish or what? Is this a fish? <laughs> yes, it's a fish, all right. <laughs> Good less. I can get this one. I already have one of these, as you can see. The round, round the bottom 
right of the screen there says it says amount and it has one instead of the others have mostly zero which means I don't have them they're actually beautiful and it actually chain cycles it did I use it? yeah I actually used it don't really bother looking at these these are all ugly I don't like to use them whoa oh I'm still gonna buy this really they're awesome uh, damn it didn't show you that well as you can see up here uh, you have scraps that are that are left after you buy or upgrade any weapon um, just gonna show you the rest just show you some of the weapons I think it's they're more beautiful these all these weapons are beautiful the ones that are made from light crystals uh, this is made from pepino pumpkin <laughs> yeah I have one of these as you can see um I'm just gonna show you the gun license switch access. Now a thing okay, no no this one. Raytheon. Is it Raytheon? Yeah, Raytheon. Now one of the things that's just for the biggest change in what ter in terms of weapon evolution is actually the bogans. Well uh you can buy them of course, like last in the other in the other games, however there is one major difference which is right here when you upgrade a uh, bogan you actually get another bogan before you, you wanted a new one you had to buy while here you can upgrade uh, an old bogan into a new one here you can see roaring sling becomes roaring stream no is it the opposite? no that's it becomes roaring stream let me just buy it oh no I make it good one <laughs> These are some of the weapons I already have. Don't really have much. I already sold lots of weapon I had. Equipment pretty much showed you all the equipment I had. I actually have a good collection of switch axes, dual so swords, and basically the stuff I usually wear. These ones I'm not gonna upgrade anymore. Maybe sell them. As for the decorations, new new decorations. Yeah, that uh, guy I just killed, which I hadn't killed any. Uh, another good thing is you press select and you can actually see by skill which makes finding the right tool easier because they're just ordered like this oh another thing I forgot to tell you is that here in the armors you can press select so it's right right now it says current gunner if you press no what is it triangle no I'm sure it was here oh right now uh, it says current gunner, but below it says type blade master use. Now it says gunner use and both. So you can choose to see only the blade master weapon, the armors, only the gunner wa ar armors, and both. Which is kind of useless seeing both. Uh, it's something useful, nonetheless. Has for the or scraps, which I show you. This is what they're for. This little cat here. He has the blacksmith, which allows him to make weapons for my cats whoa <laughs> this one's a cool one giganox oh nice has a nice affinity uh this one's made of okay pumpkin scraps yeah you can also make helmets and that's also something hard which is you can press square and select the cat you want uh to be equipped so if for example right now I equip this let me see something I'm gonna buy no, I'm just going to buy something for you for your PD. I'm going to buy these horse scraps, which I have a lot for my weapons. And for example, he's not right here, but right now he just got this equipped on him. My PD. And crap, I just realized you didn't have any sound on the entire video. Didn't really miss, <laughs> <laughs> miss much. <laughs> Sorry about that, you didn't have any sound. Um, anyway, time to say goodbye. Come on, piggy, don't feel sorry about... Ah, oh, I can't believe it. Usually when I go here to sleep, my pig actually goes, but because I fed him wrong, he actually ran away. Well, goodbye.